Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to record mixed reality videos from your Oculus Quest using only an iPhone or an iPad, without a green screen and without a PC. Let's get started. First things first, here's a list of everything we're going to need. An iPhone or iPad with an A12 chip or newer, an Oculus Quest 1 or 2, a 5GHz Wi-Fi router, and a tripod for your iPhone. Before we begin, make sure that your Oculus Quest and your iPhone are both connected to the same 5GHz Wi-Fi network. We also recommend keeping your iPhone and your Quest in the same room as your router, to make sure that we'll have a strong Wi-Fi signal. Next, let's install the Reality Mixer app on your iPhone. That's the app we're going to use to record our mixed reality video today. You can find it on the App Store, just type Reality Mixer on the search bar. Now let's install the Oculus Calibration app on your Quest. You can find the link in the description of this video. Open this link on your iPhone and tap on the open button on the top right to navigate to the Oculus app. Now tap on the install button at the bottom of the screen. We now have everything we need. Let's position your iPhone and launch the Reality Mixer app. For better results, Point the iPhone camera to a wall and make sure there are no objects between the camera and the wall. Now put your headset on and launch the Oculus Mixed Reality Capture Calibration app. Allow access. The calibration app now shows your Quest's IP address and it also shows that it's not connected. Go back to the Reality Mixer app on your iPhone, tap on Start Calibration, and type your Quest IP address. You don't need to change the scale factor, just tap on Connect. Allow the app to connect to devices in your local network, and also allow it to access your camera. You won't be able to move your phone during or after the calibration. Now put your headset on again and take your right touch controller. Bring the right controller's trigger button as close as possible to the iPhone camera, and then press the trigger button. Now take one or two steps back while facing the camera, stay still and press the trigger button again. Go back to your iPhone. You should now see a photo of you in a blue circle. Use your finger to move the blue circle to where the right controller is on the image, and then tap on Next. Put your headset on again if you'd like to check the calibration. You will need a second person looking at the screen. Tap on Save to Headset to save this calibration. Remember, you cannot move your iPhone now, and do not start Mixed Reality Connection yet. Now quit the Oculus Calibration app and start an application that supports Mixed Reality Capture. In this example, we're going to use Beat Saber. Beat Saber won't allow us to use Mixed Reality Capture until we enable it, so let's do it. Navigate to Options, then Settings, MRC, and let's switch it on. We can now start the Mixed Reality connection. Go back to the Reality Mixer app, tap on Start Mixed Reality, and then Connect. You will see a black screen at first, but the app should display the Mixed Reality video when you start playing.
When you're done, tap on the screen once and then tap on disconnect. Make sure to disconnect before you quit Beat Saber and start another game on a quest. You can use the iOS screen recording feature to record your video. You can do that by opening Control Center and tapping on the record button before you start your mixed reality connection. If you don't have this button, open the system settings, navigate to Control Center, scroll down to more controls, and then tap on the plus button beside screen recording. And don't forget to tap on the record button again to stop recording. Here are some things to remember. You will need to calibrate again if you reset your Guardian boundary, if you move your iPhone or if you install a new game. And if you're having performance issues, check your Wi-Fi and make sure that you're using a 5 GHz connection. Or try choosing a smaller scale factor before calibrating and then calibrate again. You can also find more links in the description below, including a link to a list of compatible games. Make sure to subscribe for more mixed reality and virtual reality contents and tutorials. Also follow Reality Mixer on Twitter and share your videos using the hashtag Reality Mixer. And I will see you next time.